A three-decade-old cold case murder could be over as soon as Thursday. Over the weekend, a man surprised police by turning himself in for the crime. The murder happened in 1986. A man was robbed and strangled to death at a Longview motel. Police could never make an arrest, and the case went cold for 32 years. k Keaton Thomas is live in Longview with this story. And Keaton, this case came to an end pretty abruptly. Yeah, well, that's exactly right. It ended here in, in Longview when a man simply walked in to the Cowlitz County Hall of Justice on Friday and then confessed to robbing and killing a man at the Oregon Way Hotel here in town. Now, he was booked into jail later on that night, or I guess you should say early Saturday morning. Police pretty happy about this, and they say that the family was taken by surprise. Monday afternoon, Glenn Adams appeared on video before a Cowlitz County judge charged with murder and robbery. But it took 32 years, at least two states, and a confession to get here. 30 years in the making, um, it got solved um, relatively easily. Sergeant Chris Blanchard is a spokesperson for Longview Police. In March of 1986, he says officers responded to a death investigation at the Oregon Way Hotel. It's a gentleman's hotel used as temporary and low-income housing. 53-year-old Russell Haynes was found strangled to death inside, but investigators were stumped. We didn't have any suspects um, that were uh, sufficient. We had sufficient evidence to charge at that point, um, and the case um, was cold for the last 30-plus years. The first crack came last July when Adams went to police in Santa Barbara, California to turn him in for the 1986 murder. He left before being interviewed. We basically reopened the case. In September, Longview police interviewed Adams at the Klamath County Jail where he was staying for an unrelated matter. He wasn't ready to provide a full confession at that point, saying he wanted to speak to his brother further um, before he turned himself in. The confession came Friday when Adams showed up unannounced at the Cowlitz County Hall of Justice. Adams told police back in 1986 he was also living at the Oregon Way Hotel. He said he needed cash and knew Haynes had some, so he strangled him and took 400 bucks. Adams told police that he wanted to right the wrong that he had done. Blanchard says they verified Adams' confession, then made the arrest.